Hey, hey pals. pals. So we just finished breakfast here at Ohana. And we've challenged each other. We've parked here at the Polynesian and our room is ready at Bay Lake Towers. So me and Jackson are gonna take the monorail and Haley's gonna drive the vehicle over to Bay Lake Towers. We're gonna see who gets there first. Is it faster to take the monorail or faster to drive from the Polynesian Resort? I'm leaning, since it's so early in the morning, I'm leaning monorail's gonna be faster for sure. Well, let's see. All right. So I have made it onto the monorail. Now I'm deciding if I'm gonna stop at the Magic Kingdom and walk over to Bay Lake Towers or ride it over to the Contemporary and get off and walk. take an elevator down to the fourth floor. The fourth floor is also where Chef Mickey's is located and some of the shopping um, within the resort. And now I'm going down to the lobby area and gonna walk over to Bay Lake Towers. I would say I'm in a hurry and would be running, but Haley has already beat us to Bay Lake Towers. There she is, Bay Lake Towers. There's the boat going from Wilderness Lodge to Magic Kingdom, and we are driving under it, headed to the Contemporary and Bay Lake Tower. And there's Space Mountain. We're turning into the Contemporary. So I'm at Bay Lake. I've got all of our stuff right here. It's Bay Lake Tower. And I'm fairly certain Jessica and Jackson are on this monorail right here. She sent me a selfie and it looked like it was on a peach monorail. And there it goes. So let's see if I can get to the room before them. But you can see Cinderella's Castle right there. Space Mountain right there. And here's Bay Lake Tower. So I'm in our room. I guess this qualifies as a win for me. We have made it. Hi pals. We are here at Bay Lake Towers and we have a standard room with a lake view. And we are going to give you a room tour this morning. Hello. Okay, so as soon as you come in, you have the bathroom right over to your left. Fowls. So it's a sink. You have your H2O products, your facial soap, and your lotion. You have plug ins here. Some hand towels, wash rag. You got the tissue. Let's see if there's anything in here. Your extra paperware, you need like toilet paper, and your hair dryer. You got some more towels over here, wash racks, your toilet, and then here's your shower. It does have a tub, which is great if you have littles or if you need to soak after a long day at the park. You have more towels. You have your curtain rod here great 
for when you need to hang your swimwear. And it's just a normal shower, just a basic shower, no rain, uh, fall shower or anything, or handheld. You do have a safety rail. You also have your H2O products here, and they're not mounted on the wall here at Bay Lake Towers. You have your body wash, your shampoo, your conditioner, and bath soap if you prefer bar soap. And here on the shower curtain, I don't know if the camera is doing this justice, but there is Mickey Mouse, the big guy himself, all over the shower curtain. I believe it may be hard to see on the camera. And you do have a barn style door here. Right here for privacy. And as soon as you come out and you move over to the left, you have your kitchenette area. And I think this is fabulous. There's so much space in here. You have cups up here for coffee. You have paper plates, bowls. You have, and I know I say this friends, but check this out. There's hidden Mickey's. Or they're not too hidden. <laughs> There's Mickey's all over the disposable coffee cups and I just love it. You have glassware here if needed. If you'd like a drink, turn on this light. There's a light right above the sink. You also get dish soap. You have a coffee maker. In this first drawer, you got the Joffrey's coffee and it is the 50th edition plasticware can opener I think that is so handy you got some creamer and sugar room for storage you got more paper towels you have a hand towel which I think that is great that they have a bar right here for your hand towel that's awesome your trash can, more dish soap, and your paper towels. And then we move over up here, you have your bucket for your ice. You have a microwave, and I love when they have microwaves, and a toaster, and this is a large toaster. It has, it can hold four pieces of bread, bagels, whatever your choice is. And you have your mini fridge down here. I love that it's actually a fridge. Oh! And it has a place, a little freezer. So that's fancy. That is awesome. Okay. We have our trash can. I'm gonna move it out of the way and see what we have right here. Oh, we have oodles and noodles of storage here. Just tons of storage. That's awesome. But it's also just so compact. You have a lovely full length mirror, towels. Oh, and you have another mirror over here. It's great, storage down here. I feel like this area right here would be a great area to get ready, actually do your makeup. Anybody who needs to do their makeup, do their hair. You got plugins over here for your products or if you just need to freshen up, makeup, hair, all those personal needs if the bathroom isn't available that's really nice that there's a mirror here with good lighting <laughs> yeah and then you have that full-length mirror and I want to mention again guys that this kitchenette area is huge I think out of all the resorts that I've seen um, for a studio room, this kitchenette is huge. It has its own little room, which I think is awesome. And right across the way of the kitchenette area, you have a closet, which has dual doors. You have extra pillow, you have extra pillows and blankets up top. Plenty of coat hangers. Plenty of coat hangers. You got your iron, your ironing board. You have your safe. This is where your safe is located. And you have a huge, um, huge luggage holder. I feel like that looks awful large. 
And then plenty of space down here to put your luggage. So right past the closet is when you enter the, the studio area with the bed and the couch and your TV. The drawer area looks like you have four drawers here. Um, they're pretty deep. So you've got plenty of room for storage. It looks like you have two large size and then two mid size drawers here. You also have a TV. Let's see. Oh, and you have storage right here, right beside the TV. And you do have a queen size bed here. You have a nightstand. You have two lights on both sides. I haven't walked over here and turned on that one, but um, each person can control the light on both sides um, or on their side. And then you have Mickey right above the headboard. That is just awesome. Having Mickey up there. I'll go over here and I'll show you. It's just a push button. Easy if somebody needs a light in the middle of the night. And then you have a couch. A little ottoman here. And this couch does turn into a bed. I believe it's a full size, if I'm not mistaken, a full size bed. So you have a queen size bed and a full size um, couch bed because this room does sleep four people. And right up here, I just love this. It's like, this looks like Mickey to me and this looks like a spaceship. So is Mickey on Astro Orbiter or is Mickey on Space Mountain? I don't know. I feel like it's Astro Orbiter, but I definitely feel like that looks like Mickey. And then over here, you have a table, a nice size table. It's oval, oval shaped table um, with two chairs. You have another mirror. It seems like they love the mirrors here at Bay Lake Towers. You have another light. And now we're getting ready to go outside and check out the balcony. Let's check out our view. We got a lake view. We are here, we are on the second floor. I feel like it's a very nice view with the trees and the lake. You can see Space Mountain right there, Space Mountain. Um, if those trees wasn't there, those ponds right past Space Mountain, you could actually see Cinderella's castle. I can see you're starting to peek through um, the trees right there. So out here on the balcony, you have two chairs. And then you have this little space over here. There's no table out here, but they are two chairs. And these chairs, they look comfy to me. I believe Haley has pulled out the couch bed. We're gonna go in here and check it out. I'm gonna show you what it looks like with the couch bed open. And here is with the couch bed open. Like I said, I believe it's full size. It would fit two people. Nice. Two adults. I will say, I do think it looks a bit shorter than an average bed, but I do believe it would fit the average adult. I'll get a view over here with. So you have your main bed here and your couch bed open. You still have plenty of room if you choose to leave the couch bed open. There's still plenty of room to walk. If you're somebody who don't want to put the couch bed up every day that you're at the park. But I think that wraps it up for the room tour. And again, this is Bay Lake Towers, a studio room with a lake view.
Thank you, pals. If you like this content, please like and subscribe. And subscribe for more content, for Disney content, for travel content, um, and for travel content with toddler. Thanks, pals.